Rob here doing a response or a review. James Arthur sings Marvin Gaye, Let's Get It On. Obviously a little switch from some of the genre and style he's used to, but hey, this guy's going to be the winner, friends, with Ella Rad. It certainly was going to be between him and Ella. He's a great find. He's a great talent. If you think James should or could be the winner, hit the like button. Give me your comments. And, you know, it's no secret. God has given a special gift any uh, and for James Arthur to have the ability to become a great vocalist, a great singer, a great entertainer, the same way God's given everybody gifts and talents under the sound of my voice. And the Lord has a special plan for James Arthur, the same way he has a special plan for everybody under the sound of my voice. And, you know, how do I get from James Arthur singing, you know, uh, Marvin Gaye to God as a plan? Well, I'm a minister of the gospel. If you desire to subscribe to my ministry channel by YouTube, go for it. Hit the subscribe button. And, you know, God not only has a special plan for James, he also has a special plan for everybody. And really the plan the Lord has for everybody is he desires to be in the center of our life and the heart. But the only way he can have that plan fulfilled is he has to have an invitation. The Lord will never come crash, knock, blow the door down to your heart. God's not a party crasher. God gave us a free will so we can accept him due to obedience. We can reject him due to disobedience. But <clears throat> one thing I promise you is this. Once you open the door of your heart just to crack, the Lord will come in with his great grace, mercy, compassion, kindness, and most of all, his irrevocable, unconditional love. And the Bible says in the book of John, the New Testament, third chapter, 16th verse, for God so loved the world, that's me, that's you, that's James Arthur, that he gave as a gift his only son, Jesus, that if you would believe, receive, and accept Christ, you would not perish, you'd have everlasting and eternal life. And you know, the Lord desires no one to perish under the sound of my voice, but he wants all to have <clears throat> the assurance and the insurance that when we all take our last breath, we can and we will make heaven our home. And the only way we can have that insurance is by having our lives surrendered and submitted to the Lordship of Christ, my friends. Hey, if you desire to recite a simple prayer after me, say, Jesus, thank you for dying on the cross for my sins. Thank you for being my Lord and Savior. And if you're bold enough in the comments section, put, I prayed the prayer. I want to pray for you. I'll never be able to accomplish that individually. But there's no distance in prayer. I can pray for you from the United States and New York. And Again, getting back to James Arthur, friends, if you think you should or could be the winner this year, UK version, the X Factor, hit the like button, give me a comment. To me, he's a lock winner. I don't think there's any other chance, anyone that's going to beat him. But hey, you never know. Ella got voted out. It's a fallible system, the voting system. Friends, the Lord loves you. Trust in Christ today. Don't ever forget that. God has a plan for your life.